fish, frozen fish, and processed fish, all from sources which claim to be sustainable. An MSC certified product. The results show that the Pacific cod was actually Alaskan pollock. According to advocacy group Oceana, one in five samples of seafood that they tested was actually mislabeled. Everywhere I go in Chiang Mai, someone is peddling produce that's labeled organic. Yo, these carrots are so fresh. You can still see the soil on them. We believe that it's organic. But the point is that we don't have to believe 100%. Technically, we can just wash and cook our vegetables so the pesticides go away, right? So we use a lot of water that is much higher than the 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 water. organic and fake organic, which are also in the market. In the market, outside of the farm that is made of organic, if you go to the customer, you can find the customer. The customer will find the customer by buying from the farm organic. Now, when the customer is organic, it's better. So if I can just ring up the, grow, the, the supply and say, you're stating 100% organic of these ingredients, can you please send me over your certs? The minute they start to hesitate, we just we know there's something going on. If you trust your supplier and we know where it's come from, that's enough for me to serve to my customers. So when I buy an eco-label, it's often a leap of faith. 